If you're about my age, around 50, you might remember in geography class when you were a kid, they taught us different products that are used for different things, like our Indian Native American friends use corn that they called maize. And of course, corn is very versatile for its oil and so many things, but there's nothing better than just a piece of corn on the cob on a summer day dipped in melted butter, is there? Now, everyone likes to, uh, you know, and has different ways of roasting or cooking corn. Out in Eden, New York, uh, they have a corn festival every year, and a lot of times it's just right out of the steamer or the boiler. What I like to do is, uh, I like to use the old method of, of soaking it in water, but what I do is I take the outer husks off, put in a little water. I don't want too much water, because I don't want it to steam, I really want it to roast. I'll leave a few layers of, see I took most of the husks are off of here, just a, the last layer with the, with the silk is on them, and I put them right on the grill like that, you roast it for, I'm going to say, 30 minutes or so. And when you open it up like that, you see you've got that beautiful, beautiful kind of sugars coming out of it. It's starting to caramelize that wonderful, wonderful corn. We get it from Florida. We'll be getting it from New Jersey. And soon enough, we'll be getting it right here in western New York. Fresh corn off the cob. And it's best, isn't it, dipped in butter. Until next time, God bless.